So if I'm playing rudiments, I do go from a traditional standpoint. I will always start playing things like doubles and singles from um, the way I was taught as a very young drummer, from slow to fast to slow again. You get a chance to examine your technique and to make sure there's no, um, you know, you're not too uh, tense when you're actually playing the rudiments. So this is a little example of just a simple double stroke roll. That's a good traditional way to work on your rudiments as prescribed by drummers that come from a, a military or marching band tradition. Now as kit drummers it's really really important to keep time as I said so the click track I use to, to develop rudiments and to help uh, my students to, to, to develop their rudimental playing or their technical playing. So for example I'm going to put a click track on and then I will play the rudiment at the same uh, along with the click track at a, a 16th note subdivision so it sounds like this. One e anna, two e anna, three e anna, four e anna. <laughs> Now if you were to do that for five minutes every single day, you can actually work out how to really chart your practice. It's a very, very simple progress. So I would mark the tempo down um, and what I'm playing it at, um, however beats per minute, I'll just check what beats per minute I'm at. That's at 90 beats per minute. So I'm playing 16th note subdivisions at 90 beats per minute. So I might do that for five, 10 minutes a day, every day. Little and often is really, really important. Don't think that you're going to get away with doing all your practice on the, the night before your lesson on a Saturday morning because it's not going to sink in. So just try to do a little bit every single day. So at 90 beats per minute, I'm playing the double stroke roll at 16th note subdivision. So for every beep, one, two, three, four, there are four notes being played on the snare drum. I write that down, play that every single day. This is exactly what I did as a young drummer when I was coming up uh, learning, first learning in South East London.